Hello everyone, now let's talk about the internet and the reptiles how it destroyed the theories of capitalism. The massive use of the internet and robots destroyed the theory of capitalism. When I left China in 2020, God asked me to tell you that it is China that made the Wuhan virus. Now people all over the world have awakened and are fighting against the Chinese Communist Party, it is good. But this is not the most important thing God wants me to tell you. The most important thing is that the extensive application of the internet and robots destroyed the theory of capitalism. This is the root of all trouble in this world. This is the biggest secret. The theory of capitalism is based on the fact that 50% of GDP was paid to workers in the early stage of capitalism. It is a social relationship in which capitalists hire people. But now with the development of the internet and robots, the rules have changed. In the age of the internet and robots, capitalists are not hiring workers, but capitalists are hiring robots to make money for them. This has changed the distribution ratio of social wealth, which is now reduced from 50% to 10%. And it's getting worse. Human beings thus become social burdens and superfluous people. Bill Gates has known since 1995 that the age of the internet and robots is coming. So they had a secret meeting at the Fairmont Hotel. The decision of the deep state is because of the development of the internet and robots. Human beings become superfluous and a social burden. So it must be eliminated 80%. Georgia's steel is engraved with its plan to bring down the Earth's population to 500 million. Wuhan virus is one way for the deep state to reduce the population with a virus, and the other way is nuclear war. I see that people all over the world have been opposed to the deep state, which is good, but I think your methods need to be improved, your slogans need to be improved, and your demands need to be improved. The root of all trouble in the world lies in the fact that the internet and robots have changed the proportion of wealth distribution. Because the theory of capitalism is based on the fact that 50% of GDP is paid to workers, all the laws, ethics, social management system, economic operation system, and ideology of capitalism are all built on this foundation. But the internet and robots have changed all that. They change the distribution of wealth. Therefore, the laws, morals, social management system, economic operation system, and ideology of capitalist countries all have problems. My point is not to deny capitalism, but to restore the theoretical basis of capitalism, 50% of GDP pays workers. All we need to do is spread this idea and demand that the sum of the people's wages can reach 50% of GDP, and all human problems can be solved. We need to tax the internet and robotics companies or ask them to donate to do what we want. Why do people today suffer so much? Because you deserve 50% of GDP, but in fact, you only get 10%. The deep state uses the remaining 40% to hire police, Black Lives Matter, and Antifa to suppress and persecute the people. The Chinese Communist Party has purchased the world's largest number of cameras and face recognition devices to monitor people. All mobile phone software in China is spyware. When this idea can spread all over the world, human beings will really awaken. When all people agree with my idea, you can achieve this goal through elections. This is what we need to do, and it is also the message that God needs me to convey to mankind.